This call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance or training purposes. Implied dispatch, because your pickup deliveries are aligned back to back. If you refuse, you're going to stay like you're going to sit. Welcome back, drivers, to the Recruiter Call Channel. And in this MTC, we're going to be looking at nationwide cargo out of Dundee, Illinois. That's East Dundee, Illinois. I can't tell if this is a black ops company or not, but it's a 1099 company from the conversation that I had with the recruiter. I couldn't find anything else on this company i looked up the website and the website is just as bland as bland can be but i have found some reviews from this company and they are definitely definitely not favorable so with that said we're going to go ahead and see what some of the drivers had to say about this company before we get into the call so if you want to know more about nationwide nationwide carriers out of dundee illinois stay tuned do you help drivers that's in the sap program with their return to duty status that's on a case-by-case -case basis that gets decided upon other factors can you break them factors down for me or no? So you have to have a job consistent with your previous jobs more than seven months at a time at one spot. If you don't have that, that's considered job hopping. You're not going to qualify. But but you but what you are saying with with those stipulations that you are able to help with the return to duty status for SAP We drivers. could do a return to duty. Yes, that's fine. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Uh, how much experience do you guys require? For staffs, it's two years verifiable in the semi truck and three months at least with the reefer. What about drivers that's not in the staff program? Year and a half. Pre employment drug screening, hair follicles, or urine, or both? Urine. What lanes do you guys run and do you guys run Canada? 48 states, no New York Island. What about Canada? No. Mileage pay, is it pay per mile or by percentage? Pay per mile. 70 cents a mile. 70 cents per mile. Is this W-2 or 10.99? 10.99. So this is 10.99. That's all mentioned in the email that I want to send you. That's why I'd rather send an email first and then any additional question that has not been mentioned, I'm more than welcome to answer. I, I like to conversate. How many? How are the miles calculated? Is it calculated zip to zip or practical? Zip to zip. All right. Will my dispatches come through my cell phone or would it come through a tablet on the truck? Some Sierra and cell phone. Now, as far as cell phone, do we get reimbursed for cell phone usage? No. It's your personal number. You should be ready to work with the number. So, no. Right. But I wonder why I'm asking this because you guys are sending job information through our personal phones. That's why I'm asking. Right. It's, uh, oh. well, you can you can put it in for reimbursement when you do your taxes, by all means. That's ten ninety nine, so you can write that off. Oh, I I got you. I got you. Yes, are sir. the miles are the miles consistent? Yeah, we don't have layovers. Every once in a while, depending on the weather, it could happen, but in general, we don't have layovers. Awesome. What about forced dispatch? Implied dispatch, because your pickup deliveries are aligned back to back. If you refuse, you're gonna stay. Like you're going to sit. Being that this is 1099, is there any type of escrow that's coming out of my paycheck as well? The escrow is $100 per paycheck for 12 consecutive paychecks and then gets reimbursed to you 45 days after your last paycheck with us. So after your last pay period with us, 45 days after that, it gets uh, put in into your direct deposit account. What about what about the equipment? What what are they covering that and what's the equipment I'll be driving? Cascadia's. Yeah, Cascadia's 2020 automatic 72 pedal and cruise with refrigerator and inverter. Every once in a while, you would see a PU, uh, APU in the unit, but it's every once in a while, so it's not guaranteed. Do you guys have cameras in the trucks? Outside facing only, like forward facing. Gotcha. I don't care what happens in the cabin. Of course, this is 1099, so you guys is not offering no type of benefits or anything like that? No, sir. You only have... um. Um, life policy, life insurance policy with us up to a million dollars, and you have 
um, occupational accidental insurance. Gotcha. Uh, pet and rider. We cover that. Pets, yes. Rider, how young? Rider, it depends. Um, if your performance is fine, they would not mind. In general, we say no. If you want to have someone, we need their ID and we need to sign a form. We need to know how long they've been traveling with you because it's a t it's a time frame kind of verification, sort of say. Awesome. Being that this is 1099, do you guys offer lease purchase opportunities or no? No, sir. We do not have that. We used to, but we cut that program off. It wasn't making money for the drivers, and we don't want our trucks like left anywhere in the United States, but here. Oh, I got you. I got you. My last couple of questions, and thank you for taking sure. the time with me. Um, oh, no, no, not a problem at all. Do you guys have any type of sign-on bonus? No, sir. And what about team opportunities? No, sir. All right, awesome. And let me circle back around to the SAP. As you said before, it's on a case-by-case -case basis, and one of those cases is that the the driver couldn't be job hopping pretty much, and you guys... Previous, yeah, previous job hopping is, it kind of spells out that this person is not in it with the right mind, whatever, and with the SAP, it just adds up to, like, I guess a stigma over people. But uh, if you've had, like, in the past three years, if you've held a job down for a year, then that should be fine. All right. Let me ask you about the job, per se. Does it, is it, sure. does it has to be a trucking job or a trucking regular? Trucking job, yes, sir. has to be a trucking no, job. No, sir. Yes, sir. Very good, ma'am. All right. Well, thank you very much. I really do appreciate the opportunity, and thank you. Yeah, no problem, sir. All right, ma'am. Thank you. Bye-bye. Nationwide Cargo, everybody. Out of Illinois. Yes, sir. Now, I can't honestly say if this is a black ops company or not. Because, as I said in the conversation, I couldn't find anything, anything on this company. I, I found the website, but... The website don't pretty much give us any type of information. And as far as the Facebook page goes, it's, it's the same thing. Luckily, I was able to find this recruiter's phone number on the Facebook. So I was able to get in contact with her. Well, as you guys hear, they are SAP friendly. They will help you with your return to duty status. But there's a caveat. There is a case-by-case -case basis, and then one of those particular bases is that you can't be a job hopper, meaning that you can't be from job to job to job. They require you to be at a company for at least a year, maybe six months. Ask her when you talk to her about that. They are 1099 company driver with no benefits. You can bring your kid or you can bring your rider. You can bring your pet. No incentives, no teaming, no lease purchases. So if you guys are interested in nationwide, 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 is it nationwide? All right. If you guys are interested in nationwide cargo, the information will be in the description below. Let them know Lockout Men sent you, and shout out to the recruiter for giving us this good information. Drivers, have you driven or drove for Nationwide Cargo? If so, let us know of your experience in the comments below. SAP Driver, SAP Driver, are you guys having any experience with Nationwide Cargo? If so, let us know of your experience with the company in the in the comments below if you guys like to come on and share your stories you can do that by the gmail that's lockout man podcast guests at gmail.com drivers get get your suggestions ready for the next mtc you definitely could do that with the gmail that's lockout men podcast at gmail.com or you can leave it in the comments. Yes, sir. Or if you like to support the cause, you can do that by Cash App. That is dollar sign, Lockout Men. 
let us know who you would like to see in the next MTC in the notes, and you will receive a shout out for the coffee. Thank you for listening. Until next time, everybody. Who's next? Next, next, next.